What I love about AWARE is that they are a community and community builds strength in numbers. This is an incredible group of people. I feel so supported and encouraged in my own journey. And I love that they also give locally. There are so many families and incredible um, foundations that help with research for Alzheimer's and want to find a cure. Aware at its onset was, um, was fairly simple. It was founded by Evelyn Ponder 30 years ago. And with the leadership of Cindy Hudgens, they came to be a very strong fundraising arm. I think from its inception, AWARE recognized the fact that the caregiver is often the most overlooked person in this journey that a family has to take with this disease. AWARE stands out as um, a unique group um, in the sense that they're not just one group. They financially support multiple groups in the Dallas-Fort Worth area that support things that family of diagnosed folks need. We are so grateful for the support of AWARE. As a dementia specialist, I see the impact of Alzheimer's disease on patients and their families every day. This grant supports an on-site care and support specialist from the Alzheimer's Association. Our goal is to walk alongside our patients and their families as they navigate this difficult disease. Having an on-site care and support specialist allows us to do that. Thank you so much to the AWARE Foundation for all that you've done to support the C.C. Young Music Therapy Program. With this special program, we can bring clinical licensed music therapists into our facility to work specifically with the residents that have dementia. These are the ones that don't really get involved in big programs, but they have a lot to offer. And by music therapy coming into our facility, we can reach them in a way we haven't been able to before. So thanks to the AWARE Foundation for all that you've done for us. Thank you to the members and supporters of AWARE for funding the I'm Still Here program here at Fowler. I'm Still Here is a nationally recognized model of excellence, expanding our quality care and creativity in serving those who live at Fowler with dementia. I'm Still Here says, I'm still here regardless of my cognitive decline or the progression of the disease. You know, I tell you, um, if you had to walk this path alone, you know, without organizations out there to help the cognitive impaired, without, the, without folks to help the caregivers uh, like AWARE, I can't imagine how, you know, lonely that would be. I really miss my mom. My mom is, it's just so hard to see somebody that you adore and have, she's been your rock for your entire life. And so to see the person you know become somebody different is just, it's so hard on us. My encouragement to anyone who has a relative or family member that is suffering with Alzheimer's dementia uh, would be to be very patient because it's really easy to get frustrated when somebody asks the same question over and over and over again. But the brain is not communicating that information that you just gave them. So patience and love are my, the two biggest things that I've learned. I don't think she sees the process, the deterioration that somebody on the outside does. It's important to me that people in my generation get more involved, get more involved with AWARE. We need young minds. We need community. We need strength. And this disease, there's no cure yet. And until we have a cure, I am willing and wanting to fight. And I want people in an army to fight with us. AWARE Men Dallas is going to be an organization where we want it to be a safe place for men who are caregiving and where they want to come to, uh, to get information and resources. I think, we're the, I think we're the only men's organization in Dallas area that dedicated exclusively to Alzheimer's. And uh, we feel like that together we can make a difference in this disease. I, I would like, just would like to 
tell the girls or the boys to go what, however, that uh, I will, I know I would be here for them. I'm a part of AWARE and I'm fighting for my mom. Who are you fighting for tonight?